Hey guys, what's up? I'm Zelika. Welcome back. Tonight is the grand finale of The Mad Singer. We have Crocodile, Mushroom, and Sun. Let's see who's taking home that Golden Mass Trophy. Give it up for our panel. Yeah. Sherlock Jersey in the building. Okay. Where's that? The aging Dr. Ken Jeong. Okay, Ken. All right. <laughs> I got three guesses correct. Oh my gosh. Three yes, Ken. Guesses. Let them know, you Ken. Think you're king. Correct. It is a Ken Jung record. And speaking of keeping score, tonight <laughs> one of our panel will win the second most coveted prize in all of Hollywood, the Golden Ear Trophy. Yeah. It's a close race. She has three points and Robin and Nicole. Who was an ear trophy? Two. But uh, Ken, we're kicking things off in a big way. He's been a crowd favorite since the Jenny very, very beginning. Tonight. Let's take one final look at how the croc rocked his way to the finale. Yes, crocodile. I think I'm going for the crocodile, y'all. Oh, see horses, Super Six. I thought for sure I was going home. This journey has meant so much to me because I've gotten the freedom to completely express the real me that for so much of my life has been hidden. Tonight. I picked a song that's deeply personal to me. Growing up, my family was dirt poor, so I mowed lawn after lawn just to afford my first album, Frontiers by Journey. Tonight, I'm singing a song from that same band, channeling that tiny crockling that loved to sing more than anything. Hopefully, it's enough to win that golden mask. To their hearts. That's wow, so thank sweet. You, That's really nice. <laughs> Croc, who is your gift for? Jenny. I knew oh. you were singing a words to me. I knew it. <laughs> we all want to see what you got. Oh, it's beautiful. It's an wow. angel. Oh, my it's like you, Jenny. Just as plastic, also. <laughs> thank you so much. This is gorgeous. My bad. I'm sure that gift got the wheels turning. <laughs> Start mulling it over because you'll have one more chance to make your final guesses later tonight. Well, whoever you are, Croc, uh, you just made this competition so much harder because that was an amazing performance. Now we have a mushroom ready to turn up the heat okay, for mushroom. his final performance of the season. Here's a little more on how he went straight from your local produce aisle all the way to the finale. Being a mushroom. It's been so transformative to get to share my voice in this unexpected way. When I set out to become the mushroom, my ultimate inspiration was my little shroom, my daughter. Oh, I because her daughter. Mannerisms, her voice, her love of dressing up every time I step out on this stage. And she doesn't even know I'm doing this. So I cannot wait to see the look on her face when I unmask tonight. And you'll be surprised too. Because while most of you shocked to my music in the supermarket and heard me on the radio, not a lot of you know me by name. 
but I hope tonight changes all of that. I want to win the best singer in the name of so we know all him. Ever felt him. He's, we heard him on the radio, but we don't know him by name. That's what he said. I'm singing my daughter's favorite song, and I can't wait to bring her home that golden mask. on this show, so thank you.
Son, who is your gift for? Robin. Oh, Robin. hi, son. Hi. Thank you. Thank I you. I have a little under your chair. I'm kind of hungry. Ooh. Is it an In-N-Out burger? Unfortunately, <laughs> not. <laughs> Oh, it's a mistletoe. Uh oh. Uh oh. Wow. Oh, great. Somebody's getting you lucky tonight. Kiss yourself for hours. <laughs> <laughs> this is just a little something to say thank you for all your compliments and encouragement this season. Let's give it up one final time for that wonderful performance that we just saw from the sun. The final vote of the season. Studio audience and our super fans at home, vote now for your favorite. The performer with the most votes will win the Golden Mask Trophy. I know Sun is great, but I like Crocodile the and Mushroom. I know. The third place finisher of season four's Mask oh Singer God. is. Oh my God! I think I'm on Crocodile and my guy. Keep it 
go and give it up for Mushroom. Okay, Mushroom, who are you? No, um, I don't think I'm gonna stick with it. You know, I started off. It with couldn't be him though, no, because he actually performed a Maxwell song, so it was not Maxwell. Gorgeous. But, but that's a good choice. Have a right. But then you guys showed me the game changing clue. The ice cream made me think of Neapolitan. Mm. Neo. Ah. Mm. Sounds just like him. Super talented. I think this is Neo. Alright. I like that. That's not bad. Maxwell and Neo. Mm. Kid. You're, you're still clapping. You want to know your first impression? No. <laughs> Kid said it could be Justin Timberlake. That's, that's pretty that's reasonable. Bad. Yeah. That's pretty good. Are yeah. you sticking with that? No. <laughs> I first thought this was Donald Glover, The Weeknd, and of course, Keegan Michael Key. But none of them, to my knowledge, have daughters, but Pharrell has a daughter. Mm. Yeah. Nerd in the second package was for his amazing band, N-E-R-D. With the hat clue, it's got to be Pharrell. That's a, that's a good guess. Ooh, it is. Yeah. It All is. Right, well, Nicole, your first impression I saw that hat for the clue. mushroom was Donald Glover. Okay, that's not bad, but Donald Glover does not have a daughter, right? This is a tough one because he kept switching it up vocally every week. Yeah. At first, I was thinking Lynn manuel Miranda because of all the Hamilton clues. Mm -mm. But then I realized this person was on the Hamilton mixtape. Oh, ooh. So I think it's Aloe Black. Ah. He's got a daughter. And my game changing clue was the alarm clock, his hit song with the Beachy, Wake Me Up. There it is. Wow. That's good. That's good. What it do, baby boo? Right. I don't know who that yes. is, but I hey, trust Nicole. Billy Porter. All right, good guess. Billy Not Porter. Bad, but okay. I've been all over the place with this mushroom. <laughs> I've been thinking Jaden Smith the last no, few times. No, not Jaden Smith. Jayden doesn't have no, a daughter that we know not of. Jayden Smith. And uh, it is very hard that was to argue near with you close. after you said the name Ala Block. <laughs> I'm going to piggyback off of Nicole's guess and agree with Ala Block. I like it. Wait, you guys. Bring it. I just figured out the cookie dough. I need a dollar. Oh. It's your song. I need a dollar, cookie a dough. dollar. Totally. Oh. I need dollar, 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 dollar. That's what I need. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, you have made your final song. guesses. So let's see if Christmas is coming early for any of you. I'm going Mushroom. with Nicole we and Robin. Know. Who are you, audience? Say it with me. Take it off. Take it off. Big struggle. Stayed. I don't know well, who he know, is. Music is truly the language that connects us all, and I got a chance to experience that and do just that here on this stage. You did an outstanding job. You really became the mushroom. My daughter was definitely an inspiration for the whole Steez. I was thinking, okay, uh, you know, it's not a skirt. This is a mu this is a mushroom stem. <laughs> yes. Let's get that clear. I have yes. Let's get that clear. Stage and let them know this, this ain't is no stem. It's the stem. But <laughs> because it had a little bit of a skirt feel, I thought, okay, my seven-year-old daughter Mandela. Uh, I could I could embody her spirit while I'm doing this and and feel Aww. you know feel her energy. Ah, and you did that, okay. man, in such an amazing way. So. Wow. The artist formerly known as the Mushroom, Hello Black! This song is from one of my favorite movies. All the things we should have done that we never did. Find out who's behind the mask of our season four.
our champion, the Sun. It's time to finally announce our Golden Ear Champion. We have a clear winner. Men in Black, please bring out the trophy. Who got the most right? Nicole or Jenny? I feel like it's one of them. Jenny, yes. Yes. Thank you so much to Mass Singer Academy for creating this award. I'd like to thank my ENT for cleaning out my earwax before this season. And of course, uh, my fellow judges for not trying as hard as me this season. Uh, thank you so much. Golden Ear winner. Alright, it's time to celebrate and try to figure out who is under the mask of the sun. I still don't have any idea. Many so it's me and Ryan, right? That's what we're all saying. Say it with me, son. We have to know who you are. Take it off. No. Take it off. Woo. Take it off. Take it off. Take it off. Take Big struggle. You're not even touching it. You're not even touching the mask. She was the best singer this season, right? I mean, so she deserves so the win. Yes. You've been in the business since you were a kid. What has this experience been like, and why would you choose our stage to bless us? Oh my gosh. Well, thank you for saying that. Um, this has been an overwhelming experience. I didn't expect this to be this much work. I have to say, <laughs> this was like I was thinking, like, oh come on, this will be easy, this will be fun, and it was a blast. I've totally been brought back to when I was a kid. And I remember I was five years old when I told everyone I wanted to sing. And I've always wondered like how I knew at that age that I wanted to sing. And I kind of discovered it again behind this mask. And it was to give and receive love. And that's like totally what happened. And here to sing for us one last time, the champion, the winner, the artist formerly known as The Sun, the one and only Lee. much for reacting with me this season it was so much fun please like comment subscribe i will see you soon bye